am so excited for today's video. So basically, my friend Adeline and I are like, I feel like obsessed is like an understatement. We're completely crazy about Cara Delevingne and we're so excited for Paper Towns to come out. So we wanted to do like some sort of collab involving Paper Towns. So she came up with the idea to do a makeup look inspired by Margot and then I'm doing DIY room decorations inspired by like some of the book illustrations and things like that. So yeah, we're like insanely excited about this collab. So if you're from Adeline's channel, thank you so much for coming over here. If you like the video, be sure to click that subscribe button down below. And if you guys enjoy the video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and I'm gonna go ahead and get started. For this DIY, we're going to put a Paper Towns quote on our pillowcases. For this, you're going to need fabric transfer paper, which you can get from Walmart or a craft store. And then what you want to do is print your text onto the paper, and different kinds of fabric paper are going to have different instructions, so just follow what's ever on your fabric paper instructions. So what I'm doing is I'm taking my pillowcase and I'm ironing out the wrinkles. An important thing to do is once you're ready to transfer your text, you want to make sure that your iron doesn't have any steam, just because that can kind of mess up how it transfers so I'm just arranging the text in the order that I want it to be in and then I'm going over it with the iron for about 30 seconds and then pulling off the paper just be gentle with this part because you can rip it and then it's really hard to get off so just take your time and then you have some really cute pillows For this next one, I wanted to do something kind of like travel and exploration related because I thought it would be really cute. So what I did was I printed out an outline of the world and I did forget, well not really forget, I kind of excluded some islands. I wasn't trying to be mean to these islands, it's just kind of a pain to cut out everything so I was just focusing on the bigger pieces. So I got this vinyl paper from Joanne Fabric Store and it's really cool just because you can peel the back and then stick it onto whatever. So I taped my outline to it and then just trimmed around it. It's really simple. It does take a while, but like the process itself is super easy. So just play your favorite show on Netflix, cut it out. And then when you're done, you can apply it to your wall. Now I haven't tried to take this off yet, so I can't tell you how easy that is, but if you're worried about it, I would say stick the vinyl to like a canvas board or something if your parents are worried about damaging a wall, um, but mine didn't seem too concerned. So then I printed out some pictures on like this glossy paper to make them look like Polaroids and these are actually from my Instagram and I thought it would be cool to just put pictures of places I've actually traveled above it. And then I took some pens, just like the red pen on the front of the book illustration and I also pinned some places that I've traveled to and I just think this is such a cool DIY and I love it. Last we're just making a Paper Towns inspired like photo wall collage kind of thing. So I got these frames from Walmart and they were like $2 each which is kind of amazing. And then I got some photo paper. Again this is like the glossy finish just because I like how the pictures end up printing a little bit better than regular paper. And then I got a few pieces of like scrapbook paper as well because I just wanted to have a bunch of options. So I printed out a few different pictures and then just open the frames and put them in there. It's super easy and that's why I like this DIY. I feel like this would be something really easy for you guys to recreate. And I also like DIYs that literally only take like 5 to 10 minutes. I think they're the best kind. So let me know if you guys recreate this. Send me pictures if you make any of these. So that's it for today's video. I hope you guys liked it. If you have any questions about anything, be sure to leave them down below and I'll see you later. Bye!